Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. So I feel like I haven't filmed in forever ago, but I'm here, I'm finally filming. I also want to update you guys in a few changes that are going to be happening here in my channel. And I decided to start vlogging because lately I've been just out exploring, going to different places, and I thought it would be really fun just to like document everything and put it here on my YouTube channel for you guys to watch. Obviously, I'm not going to be documenting everything because obviously, like, I want to live life too, but I want to share a little part of that with you guys. Anyways, moving on to this video, I wanted to share with you guys something that I purchased a few, I want to see like two or three months ago and this is a purchase that I've been wanting to do for a really long time but I hadn't gotten around to it but I finally did and I bought myself some cowgirl boots and a sombrero honestly like where I live we don't use too much of it but we I am from a Mexican culture and I love just seeing people wear like their cowgirl boots and their sombrero I think it looks so cute and you can pair it up with so many different types of outfits and I am going to be sharing some outfit ideas if you guys are interested by like towards the end of the video. But I want to share what I got first. So I purchased my boots from Cavenders. If you guys are familiar with Cavenders, they sell all types of like country type of looks. Uh, Western and they sell like boots, belts, purses, clothes and many other things. So the boots that I was going for were honestly like around my budget you know and they had blue in it like kind of like a mint blue not like a turquoise or uh, like a dark blue it's kind of like very light but I love them and they were a little bit higher too um, from the boots that I actually end up getting so the thing with these boots were that I went various times and they had the boots that I wanted I just didn't have like the money for it yet I was just kind of like seeing what I wanted and yeah so the day that I did have the money for it, I went back for those specific boots that I had been seeing and wanting. I knew I had my mindset that I wanted these boots. The day that I got there, they didn't have my size and I wanted them that day. And I was very desperate just to like get them already and have them with me. So the lady there was really nice. She was kind of showing me like other options and... I was like, no, I want these boots, I want these boots, these are the ones that I've been wanting for a really long time, you have no idea. So she finally showed me these other boots and I was like, hmm. And then I tried on like the boot that I wanted, which was a size bigger, and then the boot that she was showing me, and I compare, I like saw myself in the mirror, and I was like, oh my god, these look so much better than the ones that I wanted. And I have been using them a lot. So they are kind of dirty and I wish I could have cleaned them but they are by the brand area and they came in this box right here. I love the box and I love that they give you the box because that way you can have them like clean and stuff if you want to store them or maybe like if you want to take them on a trip with you and you don't want to ruin them you can store them in here perfectly. So this is the box, it's pretty big, and basically it says the same thing on both sides. And then, are you guys ready to see the boots? They're so beautiful, I love them. <sighs> okay, these are my babies. These are the boots that I ended up going for. So they are brown, and then up here it has, let me just do like a little close up for, so you guys can see a little bit better. They have a little bit of like pink and a little bit of orange. I don't know, like I just love them so much. They're so cute. And then from the inside, this is what they look like. They have like this uh, purple pearl color inside um, around here and they're super comfortable. Like the first two times that I wore them, they were really tight and hard to walk in and I just felt like a goof walking around in them. but. Honestly, you just have to break them in and in Cavenders, they're also super nice because they do, like if you want to stretch out your boots, um, they do that as well for free, but it's up to you guys if you want to do that um, or just stretch them out yourself while wearing them. But I wanted to wear them and not be like too tight because I do have a wide foot. Um, so that's why I told them if they could do it there a little bit for me and then I'll just stretch out the rest while I wear them. But yeah these are it right here 
and this is how they look like they're square toed and they have a heel and yeah super adorable and I'm going to be wearing these so that you guys can kind of see like what outfits you can wear them with and stuff like that so the sombrero that I got is actually from a different store this is called the boot jack if you guys don't have a boot jack near where you live it's basically kind of the same thing as cavenders um but this sombrero didn't come with a box oh by the way I forgot to mention the price these were like around 180 if I'm not mistaken so they're not too expensive and I think they're like really well worth it but I do need to send them to get cleaned again um okay now to the sombrero <laughs> um so the sombrero didn't come with a box I actually had to buy the box separately but to me it was worth it because I can keep it clean and I can keep it stored away if I'm not using it instead of just like sitting on a shelf and getting dusted so the box was actually $6.99 which wasn't that bad and this is a box it's so huge guys <laughs> like oh my god and it doesn't weigh that much because it's just the sombrero inside but yeah the sombrero let me just kind of tell you the price ranges so sombreros can basically range from any price and depending on the quality of it the more expensive it's going to be mine was 150 i want to say but it was on sale so i got it 130 um but yeah this is um the bag that my sombrero comes in and this is the sombrero that I got it's so cute and beautiful I don't know if you guys can see like the little detail right here so it does have real fur and then it has like studs they're so pretty I love them so much and yeah so I had to try on a different uh, sizes just to see which one is better and when I walked in there guys I literally knew nothing about some sombreros I didn't even know that they had like different sizes I was like oh probably it's like one fits all but they do have different sizes just make sure that you get one that's not going to like fly away or anything this is by the brand Larry Milano and it is a 10x hat so yeah just kind of wanted to share that with you guys and here it is one more time okay and then the box if you guys are wondering what it looks like inside this is what it looks like so basically you just put your sombrero obviously in the bag but it'll go like this kind of facing down and if you put it facing down it helps it keep its shape and that way it doesn't get ruined. So yeah, now let's move on to the outfits. All of them boys are spraying down and shining their wheels. And all of them girls are getting pretty putting on heels Cause downtown there's a cover band Warming up for the freebird chant Blondes in the bathroom washing X's off their hands All of them party people stacking up in a line Pushing up on each other like it's raining outside But I'ma stay right here so we can disappear Yeah, I've been waiting all night Take me to the party, girl, in the same t-shirt that you wear to bed
chain Lay you down on a lonely sea Nothing better than you and me And that party girl 